Okay, I'm here again at the VMware V Forum 2014 at uh, Luna Park, and I came across the Shortel stand, and I saw these incredible docking stations. Now, these have been on the market for a year, and they were the first enterprise-grade stations. But I had to find out from Shortel what their connection is to VMware, and so I've come across Kevin Rossiter. Now, here's Kevin coming into frame. He is the solutions architect. He says he's not normally a guy for in front of the camera, but he's the tech guy who has all of the answers. So, Kevin, please uh, tell us a little bit about Shortel and what the connection is with the VMware, and then we're going to launch into these uh, incredible looking docking stations. Okay, so Shortel is a unified communications platform. Uh, we, uh, we've been in the industry for about 20 years now, and what, what was nice about our solution is we're exclusively IP. We have yep. no legacy baggage to, to pull into the IP world, we are IP from the get-go. So our unified communications platform has kind of four components, you know, IP telephony, mobility, conferencing, and uh, contact center. Yep. And what we're showing here is our mobility products. So we've actually got our mobility client running on an iPhone and an iPad. Yep. Now, we actually run on 50 or 60 different mobile phones, mm -hmm. but the, uh, the docking stations we have here are exclusive to Apple. So you can see here we've got one with a lightning connector, yep. and the other one over here is a 30 pin. Okay, so the docking stations are exclusive to Apple at the moment, but the actual client runs on, on 50, or, 50 or 60 different handsets. So what our client is doing is our client is a, a SIP endpoint off of our system, and what the client does is it manipulates you know, the traversal of network based on whatever network suits best for that environment. So at the moment, we're on Wi-Fi. So the call will be Wi-Fi tunneled back to our, to our, to our HQ. But if I was to walk out of the building, as the Wi-Fi degrades, the cellular voice call will be set up in the background and it'll hand over seamlessly to voice, uh, cellular voice, yep. whilst I'm on the same call. Again, same, same as, as I walk back into the office, as the Wi-Fi begins to pick up, it's going to hand over back over the Wi-Fi. And that client just maintains the best connection all the times back to the HQ. So the mobility device is very much like you know, you know, any um, desktop client or you know mobile client, but based on the mobile phone here. And what it does, I'll show you some of the features here. So we got contacts and favorites and buddies. So you know the, the corporate list uh, with the additional uh, you know, personal contacts list. Also buddies for I am and presence. These are people that I want to see all the time. Yep. And what I can actually do is I can say, well, I want to speak to Sydney iPhone. I can either call them, I can make a video call, or I can IM. In this case, let's make a video call over to this one here. So here's the call coming in. I'm going to answer with video. Yep. And what it's going to do is it's going to set up a, uh, a video call between the two. There we go. There I am in the background there. Now this one is actually using 4G on the, the iPhone and the iPad is tethered to the, the 4G on this phone. So that's the voice call inbound and outbound on one, one connection. Cool. So what's the connection with VMware? I understand you have a new client that's also a VMware yeah. client that's plugged so right into this. Our last general release of Shortel 14, uh, version 14 basically took out the last component of our system that was not virtualized to be virtualized. So at this point, everything but the endpoint, and if you think about soft phones on a, on a desktop, everything can be virtualized within VMware. And um, so, what's Preston doing? I mean, obviously, you know, they're taking advantage of the platform, but what else do you tell me about so that, yeah, specific, that specific client? Yeah, Preston Motors are, you know, very quickly, quick to adopt this leading technology. They've virtualized you know, all components of their system. I think they actually have some you know, physical appliance-based redundancy built into some of their sites. Yep. Uh, and that basically means that you know, you know, site becomes survivable for dial tone and even for voicemail in some places, if for any reason the VM's not available at that time. And any final messages for our readers? Uh, short tail, brilliantly simple. You know, we're, we're glad you stopped and, and came to take a look at our stand. Okay. We're here all day. Thank you very much. Cheers.